can't have it, you. I actually feel really sick. It is the most painful thing ever. Are you going to try for a girl? Da, da. Look at my lips. Da, da. The lips. Um. Hey, da, da. Da, da. That's not what I just taught you, Gio. Gio. Giovanni. All right, me. Gio, what time it is? Time for the gym. <gasps> this is my OOTD. When you go to the gym and you're 200 pounds, over 200 pounds, you don't go to the gym to stop. You go to survive. A lot of people ask me, Naka, you're so high fashion. That's right. I shop at Walmart and the whole tree. <gasps> Let's go to the gym, guys. <laughs> Even Gio's laughing. You see that, Gio? That's right. He's not losing. He's like, high fashion. <laughs> Period, right? Gio, we working out? Are you gonna work out with me, Gio? Why are you quiet? Health is wealth, Gio. Let's go on the treadmill. Come on. Gio ain't about it. Gio, can't go eat tongue? Eh? You don't like working out? No? Should we go eat? You wanna eat? He knows it's a trick, guys. Here, man. Put my shoes on. I'm a lady. Someone said I need to be sweeter to cameraman. <laughs> Listen to me, guys. As I speak, tie my shoes, cameraman. Cameraman is well fed and well treated. Ooh. Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna cut that, man. <laughs> Cameraman is doing his job. Even Gio knows that. We appreciate you. Let's go, guys. You see that, guys? Ever since I went to the gym, I can do this now. Before, I can even do this split, but I'm not going to do that. Before, I couldn't do all that. So, go to the gym. Guys, I've lost weight. I'm feeling good. Someone asked me, which brings me to today's video. I'm going to be doing Q&A as I roam the city of Rome. So someone asked me, Naka, have you started your weight loss journey? Yes, Ooh. I'm at the weight part. I just haven't lost anything yet. <laughs> so we're just on the weight. We're waiting for the loss part. Oh. I'm on my prime, I'm feeling like Steph. Give get my shot and I promise it's wet. Waited hey. too long, but I told him I'm next. I actually feel really sick. I pushed myself on that cardio. I ran speed 15. Oh, mates. Every time I run, I get reminded, oh, you gotta get your eating together. A key, I'd like a pro tip for people that like to run, you have to eat clean, like it's very important. Yesterday I had muffins, so I'm feeling it today, but my stomach went down tremendously, guys. Someone actually came up to me at the gym. They were like, wow, you're really good on the treadmill. I was like, yeah. I used to be a marathon runner. <sighs> Mate, it was a good workout though, but I am done, my stomach hurts. It's the muffin I had yesterday and I feel lightheaded. I didn't drink en enough water. Pro tip, when you run, make sure you have like a huge gallon of water. I didn't have that. I'm gonna go home, drink wa water. Another question someone asked, are you going to try for a girl? <sighs> As if I get to choose. <gasps> People ask me that all the time. Are you gonna try for a girl? What if I try for a boy? You know what, guys? Let's worry about losing weight first. And then we'll worry about another baby. But um, I don't know, those things, I'm not the one that chooses. I may be happy. Because sometimes I look at Joe and I'm like, why would I want another baby? Like, he's so perfect. And then other times it's like, yeah, yes. Gio, you want a sibling? Gio, do you want a sibling? Smile for yes. No. Gio, let's try that again. Gio. You want a sibling? Smile for yes. <gasps> That's right. <laughs> Anyways, guys, cameraman's gonna cook for me, Ooh. for us, and I'll catch you guys later. I thought I would answer more questions as I'm about to do my hair. So the question, and this gonna be a quick one because y'all know my little two buns, that's what I'm doing. Someone asked, 
how has the breastfeeding journey been you guys it's been a struggle i always say breastfeeding is not for the weak you guys i had so many mental breakdowns at the beginning Ooh, one thing i will say though that i'm so thankful for and i will always remember is pain meds oh hell pain meds it helped me out so much because at the beginning no one told me this but the thing is like babies to get to the milk they literally have to rip your skin out they crunch that skin on your nipples and you guys it's so painful it is the most painful thing ever can you imagine getting sliced up and then having someone like on your nipples I had episodes, you guys, but I was on pain meds, so I, it wasn't that painful to me. Ugh. I remember like at the beginning, Jill would um, eat at night, so I didn't get any sleep and I had to breastfeed. Caraman, it was too much, huh? Yeah, like, and I would tell Dominic, I'd be like, oh, I have to pump, I have to give him formula. But the thing is like, I'm thinking about sterilizing bottles, making sure the right amount of milk, too much for me, like. <laughs> So I only breastfed because like I was, it was too much. I was overwhelmed and I just couldn't do it. So I was like, you know what? Let me just stick to breastfeeding because I'm going to be even more overwhelmed if I like could do formula, do pumping. Like guys, I was going through it at the beginning. So I just breastfed by default. So yeah, it wasn't by choice. It was just, I was overwhelmed. Me and Dominic were like, just give him the tip. <laughs> careful when I do something because Jill started to like grab me and hit them. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Yo, he doesn't let up. I got my satin dress on, you know it. No one's gonna stop my dance if I'm on it. Sometimes this one, we gotta run out of the store. So, mate, I just found out that they have these pistachios. They're already taken out of the shelf for you. You see that? Work smarter, not harder. <laughs> All right, mates, we just woke up from our nap. Thank you for hanging out with us. If you have any more questions, let me know and I'll answer them. So, on that note, toodaloo.